Hello everyone, Zox here with the final card of the mini expansion review. It is the Forestcraft Legendary Mysterious Fairy Dragon 2 play point 1 1 Legendary Forestcraft Follower with Fusion Forestcraft cards that cost originally cost at least 2 play points. And whenever you fuse cards to this card, you summon a fairy and you get to put a fairy into your hand. The main body has a ward. And fan fact, game plus X plus Y, X and Y equals the number of allied forest craft followers that have left play this match split, split randomly. So what are the implications and uses for this card? Straight off the top of my head, Castell Forest, you get to basically get one, one drop fairies on the field and in your hand just by fusing a 2 play point follower, which is pretty decent. I mean, I say two play point followers, but it's obviously two play point or more followers. But the more I think about it, it's like most of the followers that Castell Forest like to play are already one play points. There aren't that many that are two or above. Unless you're playing cards like Sylvia Panther and the, other, the Tiger counterpart, which I guess th those are targets that you can use to fuse into Mysterious Fairy Dragon for. Basically, two followers for one play point, which is actually pretty decent. It kind of accelerates Castell's quest a bit, so I can definitely see, see him playing Castell. And even then, you can also fuse other copies of Mysterious Fairy Dragon into Mysterious Fairy Dragon. So there's definitely users in Castell's, Castell's quest of having 20 followers leave play. Another area where I can see this being played is actually with... Iris Soaring Sky Spirit, the Transmute deck, Transmute Forest. Since this basically fuses a card, gets breaks it up into more cards, and then you even get fairies on board for whatever needs you need it to be, as well as another fairy in hand, which you could also potentially use to fuse it to Castell. It kind of is a net zero hand size at all times. Most of the time. Yeah, you net zero unless the follower you're fusing into this card has insane fanfare or bot presence value most often than not i think you're okay with fusing a follower into fairy dragon and even then i guess as a main body this is let's let's just go with the standard 20 followers left play by turn 7 so this will become a 2 mana 11 11 on turn 7 one turn earlier we can count this as a 2 mana 6-6, six, 7-7 six, six, seven, seven if you're lucky, and another turn earlier on turn 5 is a 2-mana 4-4. Four, four. It's fine, it's okay stats. I don't think you'll be ever playing it for the body, but it is useful if you ever need it to be. You're lucky this isn't... Actually, yeah, imagine if this is one play point so it gets buffed by Castell spell. That would actually be straight up insane and crack. But as for now, it's just... A decent card, nothing special of its own. Probably will not break any meta games or will not catapult Castell Forest into tier 0 or tier 1. It's good enough. And yes, I think Forest has seen better days. But yes, that's basically all of the cards reviewed at this point. If you have any thoughts about them, do let me know down below in the comments. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!